Welcome to New Crypto Coin. We're going to do an overview of mainframe. Getting a lot of hype today because it just hit Binance. I was like, when, it hit, when I found out that it was launched on Binance today, I was wondering, well, what is mainframe? Um, I think a lot of you guys are probably like me. Well, what is the mainframe token? What is the coin? What is it about? So I want to do a quick overview to uh, let my readers know what it's about. And uh, we also got more information on knockoutcrypto.com, a more detailed overview of stuff. So, so what, what is mainframe, mainframe and um you can, you can subscribe, subscribe to our, to our channel, channel now at um knockoutcrypto.com um, right now at knockout crypto we're also on instagram twitter and youtube um so let's jump into it so mainframe is a um a messaging system platform so uh, let me just let me just break it down for you the mainframe token overview is a decentralized network for censorship resistant messaging routing the mainframe ico and the mainframe um, MFT token are launching a distributed decentralized network to dis distribute the encrypted communications and data services market. Mainframe is essentially a network of layers that leverages blockchain and crypto cryptographic cryptography for communication and sharing data in a secure and efficient manner. And, and, and I want to break this down really quickly because mainframe is basically um, a network that is um, has different layers of encryption for encryp encryption for communication and data, but it's really like a Slack. The main product is like a Slack type product. It's like it's called Onyx. Um, so it's basically for keeping your um, messaging secure as possible off of the um, off of the main off of the grid, so to so to speak. They have a great team. The mainframe team consists of twelve full time employees based in both London and remote locations. A full list of the team can be found on the website. Uh, Mick, Mick Hagen, Hagen is the CEO and founder, and founder of Mainframe. Mick has previously entrepreneurial like, experience Mainframe founding Undrip, a content discovery app, which after two years was nicked in favor of launching Mainframe. Prior to Undrip, Mick founded Zenit Zips, which was later acquired by Chegg. You know, Chegg is the uh, school text textbook online broker. Paul Youngblood is the CTO of Mainframe. He has over 20 years of experience as a full stack developer since 2009. He has held singing developer and CTO positions with various enterprises. Brad Haken is head of business development and sales. Brad is the co-founder of Vince. He also successfully found his own startup, Brandar, which was acquired. Um, and I'm going to go back because I, maybe I didn't read that correctly. At the bottom, for individuals across the world subject to surveillance and censorship to enterprises, which routinely, routinely suffer costly data breaches, the need for a better way to communicate and transmit data is clear as day. The mainframe ICO offers their network as a solution. Now, if you remember, guys, Slack has been down a few times. They've had outages because Slack is a centralized messaging app for the workplace, but they've had outages because they're centralized. So Mainframe is basically a decentralized Slack. And uh, Mainframe and its messaging app, Onyx, are like a decentralized version of Slack for the workplace communications. The uh, simultaneous decentralized and distributed nature of Mainframe improves on the model, model of the previous platforms by eliminating the possibility of a data breach or server outage. Because it's not centralized, it's decentralized. So it's a decentralized version of Slack where you know the chance for an outage is very is almost none. The main product, like I said, is the Onyx product. It's developed by Mainframe. It's an alpha version of the first DApp built on the network. Onyx is described as a fully decentralized workplace messaging tool, similar to Slack, and it's supported on all major platforms, including mobile phones. It's already functional and available for download now. This is a big plus. A lot of times you have a product coming out. Um, and they haven't built it, you know, so they've already have Onyx built, it's ready, it's, it's ready for download now, you can get it at their website, um, check it out. My biggest question with Mainframe is scaling and mainstream adoption, that's the big question. How does Mainframe get entre in the enterprises to use Onyx instead of Slack for workplace communications? How would they scale to reach more enterprise clients? Mainframe doesn't have a lot of partnerships on the website, and that's what it concerns me, because sure, the technology might be great. But if, if no, no one's, one's using it, you know, or no, no one's, one's adopting it, then it, it's, it's going to die. die. So, so it's, it's important, important for mainframe to reach out to enterprises, enterprises and have them use their great technology. And the second, the second thing we want to know is, okay, so, so we're selling this token. token. What is the token, token used for? The mainframe, the MFT token is the underlying token of the mainframe network. MFT will be used to reward nodes that keep the network running. Nodes will receive rewards for the timing and efficient relay of packets to delivery of packets from sender to receiver and provision of reliable decentralized data storages and services. Additionally, the MFT, MFT token can also be used as an exchange of value in marketplaces on the main platform. MFT is an ERC-20 token. Um, it got listed on Binance yesterday. Binance price listing uh, right now is $0.02. Cents. Um, 
fire, but unbelievable on Binance. He's seen a volume of $93 million. There's over 10,000 followers on Twitter. Very interesting. So what do I think about Mainframe? My quick overview of Mainframe. Mainframe is a project that's generating a lot of interest, good product, hype, and community support. I feel that they're missing partnerships and enterprise adoption right now. Um, and I also, I also feel like there's like lots of competition in the enterprise communication space, like Slack, and there's other, other apps out there that do the same thing, but they aren't decentralized. But I don't, I don't know, know if employers or uh, enterprises, enterprises really need a decentralized solution. I also I think, think the token supply is quite large. I will wait until after the ICO, ICO is up to find a lower entry point. So I'm, I'm going to just, you know, run this by you guys real quick. Mainframe right now, this is on coin market cap. Elms, right below two cents is at 1.9 cents. Uh, the market cap is $42 million, which is ranking it at 183 on um, on coin market cap. The volume on Binance is $107 million on Binance. The circulating supply is 2.1 billion tokens. Total supply, 10 billion. Um, so it has a quite a large supply. Um, but as you can see, you can find it. Most of the volume is on Binance, 99% of the volume. Well, 96% of the volume is on Binance. It looks like 3% of the volume is on IDX. Um, but yeah, yeah mainframe main is, is, I mean, it's, it's, it's a, a great, great technology. technology, it's a great product. product. Um, I, I think everyone, everyone is just wondering, you know, when, when it's going to get that enterprise, enterprise main, um, mainstream adoption. adoption. But it's really, it's really great because, because they already developed, developed the product, product and it's already out there, there available for download. So I think that's, that's a, a big, big step, step forward. forward. So, so now it's just marketing, getting enterprises to pick up on it and to see the value of having a decentralized Slack type app. And there's some other, other things, things that Mainframe, mainframe does as well oh, that they can they use can the security of their network for besides the decentralized app. It's going to be, it's going to be interesting, interesting to see what other, other um, dApps, dApps, dApps or apps, apps that they come out with built on the Mainframe network. But this, this one, one is, is, could be a winner. winner. The technology is very impressive. So um, um, do your own research, research before you buy and, and check it out. Um, and do your own research. But um, this was just my quick overview of Mainframe. Let me know what you think in the comments below. You can, you can find, find this video on YouTube, um, also, also on knockoutcrypto.com. Thank you for supporting us. Um, we're on Instagram, Twitter, and YouTube. Subscribe to the channel and comment on the video below. Let me Let know, know what you think about the video and the videos that you want to see. Thank you for following Knockout Crypto. Thank you for supporting.